11 years ago, right here, Chinese Prince of Gymnastics Li Ning, after 20 years of retirement, completed flame lighting ceremony for the Olympic Games. Has been held by two wires on the height of almost 10 story building. Has been running for 500 meters and it took him three minutes and 10 seconds to complete the most difficult flame lighting ceremony in the world. Yangju, This voice came from Mr. Song Shishong, CCTV's most famous commentator. In 1982 Gymnastics World Cup, 1984 and 1988 Summer Olympics, where there was Li Ning, there was Song's comment. Li Ning's whole career, the Dao Bei Rulu, the 14 world champions, 106 gold medals, the bronze medal, 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 the bronze 这个世界杯的时候，呃，十十九岁嘛。Handsome square-jawed Li Ning, who took the world by storm in 1982 at the World Cup, pull in, back out, kicks out of it, beautiful. 很多的这个命名啊，都是李宁的名称，李宁吊环犯上，还有李宁的吊环的正吊，鞍马，李宁的交叉。However, Li Ning's brilliant sports career stopped at the 1988 Olympic Games. He participated in the competitions as a 25-year-old athlete, but he made several major mistakes. Li年他也是人啊，八八年啊，看这奥运会失利以后，他镜头前微笑，实际上他走到休息室以后，他也是痛哭流涕啊，说他也是人，哎，但是他能经得起，他永不放弃，他并没有因为八八年看这奥运会
In 2009, the sales revenue reached 8.387 billion yuan, which was close to the number one in China. However, after 2010, Lining's performance began to fall off. I wanted to find out the reasons, so I consulted Mr. Simon Collins. He's an international creative master and has a very rich experience in sports branding. With the prominence of Li Ning as an athlete, though, I think there was a great pride in Chinese sportswear. So they were able to stand on their own two feet a little bit more. Running a sports company, an authentic sports company, isn't about making shoes and clothes. It's so much more than that. It's about endorsements of athletes, but also intense research and development. You know, the technical, you need scientists in your team. It's not just about making clothes and selling them. It's a very difficult balance to be both an authentic sports company and a cool streetwear company. And you need to be both, because although you're making authentic sports clothing, you're also appealing to kids that want to wear it on the street and are not going to do sport in it. So how do you do that? I mean, that's, that's tough. You need to hire designers, and you need to have people like David Beckham, you know, sports international athletes, who are also really cool. Li Ning, I think, gave me an impression that it's not the same as a normal store. It's a little bit, a little bit, a little bit. 就跟他这个汉唐奥运会摔了以后起来继续干，商场上也是一样。In order to save the company's decline, after several CEOs in 2014, 51-year-old Li Ning returned to the company management in times of crisis. He changed the company's slogan from "Make the Change" back to "Anything is Possible." 其实奥运会以后，整个中国社会消费。都发生了很大的改变，嗯，形成了很多这个叫做呃供大于求的这样环境。但真正好的商品、更有专业商品，其实还是有很大的一个需求。所以呃，在我回来公司以后，更重要是寻找到我们要往哪里走，离开这一个价格竞争的一个泥潭。所以那时候给公司确定，就如何去走更专业的、呃更更年轻的、呃更能够体现今天的。After going through a series of major changes of the brand, Lining is gradually re-establishing the position of the leading first-line brand and sport brands. Welcome to the New York Fashion Week.其实第一次我们去到纽约时装周的希望就是重新把一个品牌的一个新的形象就是带回给大家的面前更多的是希望把这个品牌就是呃过往的一些嗯陪伴呃中国奥运和中国的一些运动员经历过的一些荣耀这
跟国际间的交流是少不了的，并且可以从，我们可以把中国的文化带出去，同时我们可以把国际的这种文化吸纳进来。我们也跟国际上的这些优秀的运动员有做合作，会有像 Kiss 一些这样的一些买手店过来，就是希望能够跟我们有一个商业上的合作，然后包括我们在海外的一个发售渠道，也是通过时装周。Well, Leaning is a very smart company, and I wouldn't presume to tell them what they should do.、Uh, one thing, though, I do notice with a lot of international companies, particularly Chinese, is they go into a market, and they might not have necessarily figured out what to do about the fact that they're in it. You know, they arrive, they do a big show, and then people go, right, what next? And there isn't necessarily anything planned to be next, and people don't like that because you've got to have a consistent story. And I know Leaning has a consistent story itself here in China, but they have to consider, I think, the wider implications internationally. We hope in this process, more than we do, we can understand how to understand the sport, how to understand the culture, how to understand our own brand, and how to show our personality. I'm really impressed by Mr. Leaning. You know, the way I'm thinking about how he achieved all those golden medals in sports and then he achieved the success in business. It just strikes me because he's got such a brave heart to do things that he was probably not aware of how to do or how to be able to be doing it. Life is a race, life is sport. And it doesn't matter if it's in sports or if it's in business, you just have to do it with 100% of your might, of your will. And he's done it. 其实体育会给每一个每一个人，尤其是年轻人，带来一种积极向上，呃，用就是增加自信去追求自己梦想、超越这个极限的这么一种激励。嗯，呃，我觉得这种激励是体育精神里面的最核心的。Takes years and years and years of dedication. Running a brand is very similar. It's very simple. 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 他在这个经营品牌里边所获得的辉煌成果，他的挫折，他的这个永不放弃，所有这一切，我觉得确实是简单。你好像不可能的事情完成的很简单，所以说一切皆有可能。好，谢谢李明先生，很荣幸。好。大家好，我是李宁，祝上海爱越办越好。